Welcome back to Beyond Hanwell, psychological horror first person shooter, and this game is amazing. Thanks for joining me. If you want to see more, don't forget to like and subscribe. So last episode we did some more exploring, and I all but gave up on the House of Commons until I thought, oh, you know, I'm going to go check out Big Ben. It's right here. This is the friggin' House of Commons. We have all the IDs. So, yeah, we're going into the House of Commons. I don't know what is going to happen in here, but here we go. We're low on shotgun ammo. We have a chainsaw. We got that in the last episode. And our pistol has a flashlight, which is very handy. All right, well, I guess, I guess that's the entrance. Yeah, it looks like it. All right. Dope! What? Jesus. Let's try the chainsaw. Chainsaw sucks. Unless I can... Nope. It's basically a melee weapon that makes an obnoxious amount of noise, and it sucks. So, we're not using that ever. Ever again. House of Lords. House of Commons. Okay. Welcome to the Palace of Westminster. Oh. Fifth floor. Explore the House of Parliament. So far, looking amazing as normal. Man, it really does look great, doesn't it? What, um, I don't know what we're supposed to do in here. Just explore. That's what we're going to do. Let's see, should we go right or left? House of Lords. You guys hear that? Did you hear that? Okay. Let's go this way. What the hell is that noise? Cool looking statues. I hope they stay statues. Dude, what the hell? Bunch of books. Oh, here's a tape. Sir Michael Rowley's fixation on the past. Particularly his efforts to restore the monarchy stands in stark contrast to the realities we face today. While the heritage and traditions of our nation are indeed valuable, our current predicament demands forward-looking solutions. His divergence from our policy focus especially his unilateral actions within St. Paul's, cannot be overlooked. It's imperative we address this, ensuring our efforts are not fragmented by personal crusades. Good story. Let's read this. <clears throat> <clears throat> Beware of the House of Commons. Get on the wrong side of the director, and his new pet will suck the life right out of you. Well, that's comforting. <clears throat> Sorry, my throat's all fucked up. <clears throat> Dear Mrs. Lillington, I am writing you today to discuss the disappearance of my husband, Matthew Peck. 
The police have been less than useless in my case, and I am worried this may be a scandal that will rock the very foundations of Westminster. I just know that my husband was taken by members of the Bullington Club. I can only pray that he is still alive. Can you please impress upon the Home Secretary and have him look into this detail and find my husband who is just one of many disappearances linked to that wretched group. Yours sincerely, Elizabeth Peck. You guys. You guys, I just read something and I don't think I stumbled. I feel accomplished. Okay, let's go die. Uh, should we go check the House of Lords first? Probably. I mean, uh, we're over here. Might as well bust through this door, right? Can we? Clock tower. Staff only. Uh... Guess we're going this way? <laughs> saving. That's not a good thing. I mean, it's a good thing it saves, but it's usually a bad thing. Oh, well, this is Big Ben's heart right here. What is that? It's a tape in there. Oh, we're gonna turn this on. Ah, oh, fuck off. Damn it. Minute, oh! Stupid chainsaw. Goddamn worthless. Oh, they're stupid. I like it. I really, really like it when they're stupid. Oh my god! Jesus! Uh, Molotov? Where yet? Where yet? Where yet? Where yet? Suck it! Oh! Shotgun! Oh, that works very well. Yeah, we got you. Fuck off. No means no. Oh, that's the door I couldn't get in. Okay, reload. Get the, the... Not that. We need... Oh, you know what? Oh, damn it. There was weapons over there, huh? Look at all the materials. Rich. Oh. I need oil. I need oil for my bike. On a motorcycle. It needs an oil change. I know you're gonna change. Any of you? Nope. There's the gas. Health. Oh man, all the good stuff. Alright, we cleared it out. Let's go start that damn Jenny. I really think maybe we should head to the Lord's... the other side. But I'm going to ignore my own uh, advice and go this way. Shit. Shit. Yep. Fuck that chainsaw. 
Lord Gale Cunningham, as the head of Eastforge, producing weapons for Westminster, holds a critical position in our national defense and anomaly containment efforts. While his commitment to arming and equipping our forces is invaluable, our divergence lies in the application of this armament. Holy shit. Oh my god, all right. Don't fall. I have a feeling that will kill you. And watch your step, I guess. I don't know. No! Oh, Jesus! Got a gear. I don't really know what to do with the gear. A large gear. That's very informative. I'm not sure. Maybe a gear goes down here. Oh, wait. What the hell? How did I get over here? I have no... <laughs> okay, it's a different set of stairs. Make some ammo. This ammo is full. Nope, stop. Um, can we get out of that menu? God, that sucks. Another Molotov. I kind of, I, I like the Molotovs. They seem to do pretty good. Alright, I don't know what to do with that gear. We're just gonna keep going. There's nothing I can put it on. I don't think there's anything for me to do over there. Except for ignore that chainsaw. Chocolate ammo is full. Pistol ammo is full. We'll take the health. And the nausea pills, which we're gonna pop. We're gonna pop some pills right now. This is not where we came from. Guess we're going this way. Oh, so damn it. Maybe you are the one after all. Oh, he's up there. I must admit, when I saw you in your infancy back in the Ark, I had written you off as another pathetic clone of the Doctor. But maybe there is more to you. Oh. Ah. No. Accelerated aging taking its toll. Of course. What else would motivate you to return to the desolate hellscape of Hanwell? Hmm. Yes, you are almost there. We could certainly come to an arrangement. I just need to be sure you are truly worthy. What are you going on about? How rude of me. Let me introduce the speaker 
of the house. Oh, fuck. Watch yourself. She might just suck the life right out of you. Oh my god, what the crap was that? Oh, Jesus Christ. Okay. Whoa, 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 whoa. Here, eat it. Oh my god, she... Oh my god, okay. Yeah, you don't like that, do you? Here, have another. Are you dead? Are you dead? I think it's dead. Is that a note? Did you just drop a note? No. Alright. Molotovs for the win. Oh! Oh no! Yeah, pipe wrench. Nope. Not gonna help. Oh no. There's gotta be stuff, right? What was that? Shh, stop panicking. We're gonna heal just because we can. It's all ammunition. Well, at least we know where it's at. I just gotta remember, there's loads of it. Parliament questions. 2010. 1228-2010. Baroness Daniela M. Westminster. To ask the Minister of Defense and Arms manufa Manufacture. Can't read it, it's too damn... As to the whereabouts and or ultimate destination of certain luxury items being delivered to the Palace of Westminster, specifically the Lord's Chamber, namely cigars, wine, and occasionally cheese. I like cheese. Don't care for uh, cigars or wine, though. So that... Lady is in here somewhere, I think. More weapons. Oh. Oh, I hear her. There's shit floating around over there. There's a bell. Oh, hello. Are you stuck? Oh, my God. Oh, 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 oh. Oh, no. It's a dead end. Oh, no! I can't. I'm stuck. I'm stuck. We gotta run. We gotta run! Please don't die. Heal. We need a long range, I guess. I don't know. Is this long range? <laughs> Fuck. Run! I have no more Molotovs. Which is not okay. She's right there, though. I don't think I have... Oh, stop! Stay over there, stay over there, stay over there. Uh... I got two. I have two. Get out of the damn menu. Suck it! Oh, why'd I do that? It's such a waste. Defeat the speaker, oh my god.
Is there anything in here of importance that pop some more pills later? There's an egg. I guess we leave this place. Right here. Yeah, okay. It opens up everything. All right. And we came from there. I think. Yeah. All right. I guess we go to the House of Lords. Did we read this already? Or hear it? Differences with Dr. Dan Linwood have grown particularly acute in recent discussions, notably concerning the alarming reports of cannibalism at the Royal Hallamshire. Dr. Linwood insists nothing of the sort is happening. I personally don't care. It seems like the logical solution to their food shortages. But the optics of this, if it were to get out, are problematic. We need to investigate this discreetly and be sure they understand we are on side. If it remains discreet. Alright, unnecessarily loud radio thing. I found where the cogwheel goes. And then what? Okay, nothing. Third gear's busted. Only place you're gonna find a spare is in the clock tower under Big Ben. Not a chance they're gonna let us nick one of them. Better inform the director and pass it on. Yeah, we found it. Yeah, I think we're good. We should be able to open this now. Okay, I really wish there was a workbench. We need more Molotovs. Is that him just sitting there? Yeah. Those are switches. But right, where's, where's number one? Is it over here? Six and two. There's eight and five. What's up, dude? Okay. Oh. Kill the director. What? Not yet. Oh no. Director's office. We have to fight you now? Yep. That's not good. What, just start shooting him? <laughs> what the crap? What does this do? Absolutely nothing. So we just start shooting at him, huh? What the hell? <laughs> I was not expecting that. Well, do it. Do what? Can we sit here? Ugh. I am the king of Big Ben. Alright. Enough dicking around. I don't understand what the shit just happened. I was expecting some form of a boss fight. Here's some cigars. Dear Bullington members, the sequence this week can be found the way you came in. As ever, it is what you don't see that is important. Ready your bets. 
Or just come watch the fun. Shit. Okay, we got a note and a radio. We got multiple notes. As we touched on the conditions and steps that should be taken to reach the realm of the worthy, it would be re it would be remiss not to contemplate what it actually is. Realm of the worthy, an anomalous afterlife accessible only through death at the hands of a worthy opponent. This ethereal realm is described as a land of perpetual challenge and harmony where the bravest and most skilled warriors, strategists, and scholars reside, continually honing their abilities in a paradox of serenity and combat. It is a place where power and pursuit of perfection are paramount, and entry is granted only to those who fight with pure intentions, ensuring that only the truly honorable transcend to this enig enigmatic plane of existence. Whether it exists as a literal afterlife or a metaphorical goal for the living, it continues to inspire those who strive for power in all they do. Okay. So I need to die. And at the hands of a worthy opponent. Fuck. Uh, there's a f Oh. Uh, I'm not going to pick that up yet. I'm afraid it might trigger something. I'd rather um, do this first. We are all in agreement. The situation in Hanwell has gotten too bad to ignore. Mayor Lawson made a desperate plea for us to mount a rescue. But doing so will put wider London at too great a risk. The doctor's little experiments are too dangerous to risk getting out. Hanwell is to be destroyed, along with everything in it. Alrighty then. Let's check the email. Encrypted archived final decision. That is a lot of reading. Hope you're ready for some stubbering. Stubbering? Stuttering. Dear executive committee members, after extensive deliberation, we have reached a unanimous decision regarding the future of Hanwell. As you are aware, the situation within the city has become unattainable and the risks associated with continuing our current operations far outweigh the potential benefits. Therefore, it has been decided that the complete and systematic destruction of Hanwell will commence immediately. This decision, while drastic, is necessary to protect our broader interest and ensure the long-term stability of our other operations. The plan will be executed in several phases to ensure maximum efficiency and minimal exposure. All sensitive materials and key personnel have already been extracted and relocated to secure locations. Phase 1 will involve the, the disabling of all communication networks within Hanwell to prevent any outside interference or leaks. Following this, targeted demolitions will be carried out to eliminate key infrastructure and disrupt any potential resistance. Finally, Phase 3 will involve the thorough cleansing of any remaining evidence of our involvement. Please ensure that all departments are fully briefed and prepared to act according to their assigned roles. It is imperative that we move swiftly and decisively to prevent any unforeseen complications. Sincerely, the Director of the State. Huh. Okay. Project Resurgence. Miss Lawson, I will offer this warning only once. Take back the Ark and destroy everything the Doctor has worked on. He's gone too far, he's created an army of those things, and they are out of control. This much should have been clear when he was killed by one of them. There will be no resurrection. You have three days. If I see no results in this time, I will consult the executive committee, and we will put a stop to all the nonsense Hanwell has caused for good. Director of the State. Final Orders I'm giving you those orders directly. Today, at 8 a.m., I think that's 8 a.m. Today at 8, the Ministry of Defense and Civil Obedience will, 
on line stretch and conduct strikes on the critical infrastructure of Hanwell with follow-up strikes aimed at civilian dwellings with the ultimate aim being to the complete destruction of Hanwell. Since Hanwell was evacuated, civilian casualties will be minimal. Anybody left in Hanwell should be considered an enemy of the state. <laughs> what the hell is this? This doesn't solve the issue of the Ark. It is heavily fortified and deep underground. We can destroy it. We can destroy its overground facilities, but I am introducing DSA to enter and clear out the entire underground facility. They spelled your. It's not supposed to be your. It's your, right? Your ultimate goal is to destroy Beyond Repair Project Resurgence. The doctor had a lot of friends who all have their eye on the ministry and they want him back. Joint first objective is to investigate and destroy what you find in the doctor's private facility. We know he was doing something with his clones, but we don't know what to, ex what, to what extent. You are to carry out these orders immediately, with the official order time being 5 one, one, 2037 Happy New Year, Director of the State. Holy crap. All right. Not available. New government. That was the uh, achievement I just got through Steam. New government. Director of the state. The director. DOB classified. All access. I think we can now get into the arc. Assuming we get out of here alive. I also don't know what the hell these numbers mean. What the hell did that do? Secret stuff and things? What's going on? Okay, I, I know I wasn't the only one that heard that. Oh, what the shit? Oh. Um. Okay. Secret stuff and things. All right. It's saving. Uh, both good and- No! They're all in there. I'm wondering, you know what? I should probably kill them while they're in there. I can't. Can't kill them while they're in there. Nope. That sucks. <laughs> oh no. What's in here? Oh, no. Oh, these are all baddies. These are all super bad. Intake. Anomaly. Four burners, two spitters, ten mimics, one feeler. Peasant. Where ID... Could be verified. Matthew Peck. James. Damaged ID. Unknown homeless. Two. This one. Boys. Will be splendid. <laughs> what the shit is this? Oh no. Shotgun. Let's see. We have the pipe bombs down there, I think. 
We're gonna take a pill. We have heals. Oh, I forgot about this stuff. What is this? Oh, that's what I have. I forgot about that. Okay. Oh, no. We can't go that way. This is going to be bad. Oh, no. Oh, that door's going to close and we're going to be screwed. And this is where they watch. They watch the carnage. Yep. Everything's going to open. Um, I think that's probably one of the worst ones. I might just throw that gas over there. Everything is loaded. I have a friggin' pipe wrench. Alright, I guess... Shit. Okay. That's gonna shut. We are on there. It's definitely going to shut. I have an idea. Can I actually shoot them from here? Nope. Crap. This is so not gonna work out in my favor. Alright, here we go. Let's go. Fuck off! Did I miss him entirely? Oh my god! Oh shit. Just keep running. Just keep running. Just keep running. Where's my shoddy? I need the shoddy. We got a pipe bomb we could toss. I'm, I'm stuck! Shit! Oh, let's reload. There's more. These guys are easy, though. I was expecting much more of a fight. I can't believe I missed with the gas. That was so dumb. These are just weapons. That... Can we go through here? Oh my god, we can. But let's, uh... We need to search first. Yep, searched. I'm not going inside this gate, because if it shuts, I'm going to be not happy. Alright. We searched. We can't get in there. Can't get in there. Shotgun is reloaded. Bets. Name killed by in time. Matthew Peck. Burner. Four minutes. Unknown. Feeler, 8 minutes. James. Red. Mimics, 2 minutes. Well, hell, I did better than that. Oh, there's a bunch of rooms. Okay. Alright. Shotgun. I said shotgun. Shit. Provided overalls must be worn while using the societal cleansing rooms? Oh, God. Can I actually shoot this? No. Can't get in there.
You guys, this is a trip and a half. What's the point of coming in here, though? Can't get over there. Those are cigars and wine. Elite members room two. Elite members room three. And there's nothing in here for me. That is a big ass bottle of stuff. I don't know, whiskey? We did it. We freaking did it. We killed the director. House of Commons, finally. I had no idea Big Ben was the House of Commons. Cheers, y'all. Ah, oh, that's good. Yeah, that's good. Alright, well... Hold on, let's check our notes. Um... Hospital. <clears throat> yeah, the director, House of Commons. So I'm thinking we could probably reach the the Ark now. I'm gonna head over there. Hopefully, we just walk right in. Yeah, I don't think this is actually going to work. No, I didn't think so. Could have sworn there was a way to go through here, though. Maintenance staff, only director has access. Yeah, see, now we have control of this computer. Bypass maintenance. As you requested, the Hanwell bypass has been sealed, along with all Hanwell city gates. We've put out a statement claiming this is for return maintenance due to the increased anomaly presence in Hanwell. We've managed to spin the story successfully. People think because of the new risks, we're upgrading security through bypass and are happy about it. You can now go ahead with your plan safe in the acknowledge there is no way out of Hanwell. Uh, yeah, unlock that bad boy. Now, I do know there are mimics in here. And I'm almost certain there was a... Workbench, maybe? Yeah. Which one is it? That one! Alright, we need ammo. And the Molotov... Wait, can we make more ammo? This ammo full. Stop doing that. And the Molotov seem to work pretty good. Alright, I think we're good. Oh, you know what? Let's make an axe. Um... I wonder if this axe is better than this axe. Multi pickaxe. I don't know. Only one way to find out. Alright. I think now we can open that door. 
I don't know. I don't know if this is gonna work. Oh my god, access to Hanwell Bypass. Holy shit! Well, this... this doesn't look good. Holy shit. I am not your father. Welcome to Hanwell. Dude, what the hell? Look at this place. It looks great, but... I mean, it's been completely ravaged. What is this, nuclear, maybe? I don't know. Welcome to the safest place on Earth, and well. No. Hey, can we just go wherever we want? Can we go this way? Oh my god, we can. We can explore, I think. Can I go any further? Nope, I can't. Can't go any further. I don't know what that... That looks like a missile silo. Can't go over there either. What the hell is this? This is an old missile silo. Look at this, look at this door. That is one thick frickin' door. It's gonna shut, isn't it? <laughs> the moment I walk in there, it's gonna shut. Oh my god, damn it. Oh, we're going down. Okay, this looks eerily like the beginning of the game. The highest level, explore the Ark. I don't think we're alone. The fucking exit was welded, but I think I found a way out. We need to get to the top underground level through raw anomaly storage. Oh no. And admin, then into the main labs. From here, we can cut through the doctor's chamber into cloning facility. The doctor was always paranoid about the ministry. He absolutely had an escape route. I'm sure of it. Oh, we are so not done fighting. Take everything. Take it all. We are not done. Facility power management. That door is open. It's kind of chunky in here, guys. Not gonna lie. It's a little bit chunky. What is that? Let me run, damn it. What are you? Oh, it's just stepping things. We do need the ammo. Shotgun ammo, anyway. Don't you dare get stuck. What 
don't think there's anything up there. Doesn't look like it. Danger. Confined space. Kind of sort of used to it now. Everything has a creepy hallway. You guys, this looks freaking amazing. Knife. Here's a computer we can use. Professor Lee here. A message tool. The Ark, hidden underneath Hanwell, represents our most crucial endeavor yet. Here we push the boundaries of what's known, observing anomalies, understanding the fabric of these events. It's not just research, it's our entire future. All right. Get out. <clears throat> Get out. Sam, please don't resend this message and destroy the machine it's on once you leave. You need to get out of the Ark and away from Hanwell. I could be killed for this, but they're going to, to destroy Hanwell. They aren't happy with all the trouble the doctor caused and think it could spread to other parts of London. The HCPP amassed too much power in the Ministry feel they can't stop Project Revival without flattening Hanwell. The Director is furious that the Doctor is being resurrected. You can still get out if you leave now. The bombs will drop today. If you can't get out, then at least get below ground to the main labs, or better yet, maintenance rooms. They're sending in DTA to clear out the labs ahead of the bombs dropping. Everything above ground will be gone by midnight. Holy crap! Whoops, nope, stop. We're not done. Hazardous storage. Oh, no. Well, we don't have an option. I was waiting for something to bust through there. There's a workbench. I think we have everything we need, though. Let's see. How about another Molotov? Why not? Smoke bomb. We haven't tried that yet. We'll craft another sample 42. Axe the awful. Bolty pickaxe. I don't know what would be better. Let's try bolty pickaxe. We already have it though, so we're good. It looks like shit, though, doesn't it? The mace sucks, by the way. It's awful. Yeah, that looks better. What hell is in here? And the game saved. What the hell? What's in there? Oh shit. This is going to be a fight. Please tell me there's no sleepers. God, that would suck. I'm not worried about these guys. Let's try the axe. Or the pickaxe or whatever it is. Oh, dude. Yep. I'm loving it. Suck it. Uh, 
Dude, this friggin' pickaxe is great. The flare we don't care about. Do we have broom? Eh, kind of. We're gonna pop this. Come here, you little bastard. These guys are a little tougher. What are you? Eh, we're gonna keep what we have. I like it. Shoddy. are full. Shotgun's full. We'll take that. Live anomaly containment. Well, shit. Alright. Um, shoddy. That door's gonna shut. There's a workbench here. Oh my god! Where the hell is it? Where the hell? Is Fuck you and your spinning bullshit. Is she gonna come in here? Is she gonna come in here? Yep, they both are. Heal. Uh, two, right? Yep. Damn it. Oh. No, 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 no. I thought I would. Didn't I? Do I not have Molotovs? Shit. Why do I not? Oh my god, I don't have him equipped. I have the. I, uh, I don't know. I don't know what's happening. We're gonna go along with it, though. Oh, I could shoot that thing. Uh, no, no, no. Get, stop. Oh my god, they need to fix that. We're out of stuff and things. Oh, we have a dinky. I forgot about the dinky. We can't make it, though. Wait, wait. I want to know what's in here. Anything? Anything good. Nothing. Nothing good. I guess we're shutting it. Okay, I can shoot the explosive stuff. Where is it? I, I don't know. Oh, no. Oh, no. Can we shut that? There it is. Jesus. That thing was so fast, I didn't have time to shoot the fire. Thing. Yeah, we're, we are so shutting you in there. 
You're staying in there. That's where you live. I mean, I kind of sort of want to go in here. What if there's something cool? God damn it. God damn it. Oh, you are alive. Can I shoot? I wonder. Oh my god, can I shoot that glass thing? <laughs> That's a big nope. What? Okay. I think they all had to be shut to open that, I guess. I would have been pissed if that took, like, a key. Security at the Ark must be impenetrable. The knowledge we amass, the experiments we conduct, too vital to risk exposure. Every measure, every protocol, is in place not just for our safety, but for Hanwell's, London's, the world's. Access restrictions. Dear all concerned, the Governmental Executive Committee of Westminster, London, has mandated as of today that all access to the Ark main facility will be restricted to all staff trying to move from maintenance below ground into said main facility. The order is to be implemented with immediate effect. Yours sincerely, Executive Committee members of the Ministry of Westminster. The Ministry called. I just got an email from the ministry. Oh no, that's a question. So it's gonna sound like I just got an email from the ministry? Basically telling me to lock the sparks downstairs. Fuck that. I'm not locking anyone to anywhere. London is up to something. They never get involved in Hanwell. We provide their research, they leave us alone. That's the deal. Do you think they know about the doctor? I was under the impression everybody thought he was dead for good. Can you let Dr. Lee know? She rarely checks her emails. Len. Oh, shit. Here we go. Oh. They are killing everyone. No! I left the code for you. Well, where the fuck is the code? Oh, no. Wait, one... Okay. Let's check this room first. We're just running in. Come on, wake up. There's nothing in here. Just the number one. All right, we're going in here. Wait, room four. Computer? Nope. Three. So one, three. I don't know if it's in that order. I 
I just heard it. Oh, it's right here. I didn't wake up. Okay, one, three. Oh, I kind of just... A little bit of a... Graphical glitch. One, three. One, three. I don't see any more writing. Induction to anomalous research. Today, PPE, one hour. Covers all aspects of main lab personal protective equipment. ACP, two hours. Covers the procedures of handling captured anomalies. What the sh- Oh, no, 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 no. Shit, shit. God damn it. Is there a code in here? Seven. No! Oh! Fuck, man. Seven. One, th uh, one, three, seven. Battery. I'm going to write that down. One, three, seven. Clearance request. I've assigned the workers to start work on your requested expression. No, requested express anomalous specimen transport link to the research labs. However, we're finding it difficult to coordinate when we aren't allowed to move freely between raw storage and the labs. I'm putting in a formal request for research level two clearance. Named on the request are myself and three prefab workers. If it isn't granted, the job becomes almost impossible. One, three, seven. Have it written down. I'm getting the shoddy out. Personnel. We've achieved something remarkable today, a breakthrough in our understanding of anomalies. This could redefine the approach. God damn it. Nine. One three seven nine. I don't know if that's the order it goes. But those are the Numbers. 1379. 1973. Okay, here we go. Everything's reloaded. Progress reports on the resurrection project. Uh, our efforts to bring back the doctor have encountered significant hurdles. The most pressing issue is the severe degradation of grey matter. While our techniques can rebuild his body, the essence of who he was, his uh, intellect, memories, personality, may be irretrievably lost. We are venturing into uncharted territory with outcomes uncertain at best. 
Okay. That's eerie. <clears throat> What's going on? What's happening in the main labs? There's a lot of noise coming from the decamination room. Decontamination room. And I can't get a response to OK opening the blast door. I have four new researchers suited and ready to enter. Please advise. Where the hell are we going? Stand in designated area. Wait for gas release. Jump. Crouch. Am I supposed to jump and crouch? <laughs> oh, what the shit? Access the main labs. Oh no. Oh, that's not good. Pretty cool thumbnail, though. No, oh, Jesus! Should we stand in it? Jump, crouch, crouch, jump, jump, and crouch, crouching and jumping. I'm clean. He did not have a good day. ARC, Anomalous Research Center. Oh no. Can we go this way? It's locked. Oh! Well, that opens. What about you? You? Nope. That's a little terrifying. I can't utilize any of this stuff. Oh, there's email right there. Error. There's a tape. Reflecting on the resurrection. I'm forced to confront the hard truth. In our quest to undo death. To bring back the doctor. We might be unleashing something we don't understand, far more dangerous than the anomalies we're used to. The question is no longer can we, but should we? This project may well define or doom our entire endeavor. So, an anomaly we haven't seen yet? Breach. Oh, no. Dear all, I've been made aware that fighters from the Ministry in Westminster have entered the Ark. I know the first instinct will be to escape overground, but I have reason to believe the Ministry is going to destroy Hanwell. The safest place to be right now is in the deepest parts of the facility. Fight if you can, hide if you need to. Let the anomalies lose. So, these guys were essentially murdered. This isn't from the anomalies. Yeah, they were just gunned down. Yeah, see, look at... Defense research. Yeah, they were just gunned down. There's another tape. The recovery process of the doctor has hit yet another snag. His brain is just not responding as expected. The damage is extensive far beyond our initial estimates. I'm not sure how much of him we can actually save. Mm. Uh, 
no. What the crap, dude? <laughs> oh no. Oh no. I opened the gas valves and broke the symbiote chamber. Try not to stand directly beneath the vents. The door to the defense research won't open until the gas is purged and the symbiote is contained or killed. That should stop them getting to the project, getting to Project Resurgence, or at least slow them down enough to awaken him. Awaken what? Who? What are we awakening? Inorganic materials, organic materials. Danger of death. Anonymous, anomalous organics. Check personal protective equipment before entering. Ensure suit is airtight and pressurized. Toxic substances. Oh, shit. Um. Shotgun. Oh, there's music. Music's happening. Oh, I can hear that thing over there. Ugh, God. What am I doing in here? That'll probably give you a sunburn, eh? Oh, there's a note. Super bright, can't read it. There we go. Peace Cell, Rick Manley, C-129. The new solid-state power cell has just been completed. Designed to power an entire city for up to 500 years. This cell employs a solid electrolyte, which significantly, significantly enhances safety by eliminating flammable components. Its high energy density and extended lifespan ensures continuous and reliable power supply, making it suitable for urban infrastructure. The cell's advanced technology also offers versatility for various high-demand applications. Further research and development will focus on optimizing integration and efficiency, aiming to solidify this power cell as a cornerstone, cornerstone of future energy solutions for long-term urban sustainability. Am I dying in here? Okay, I can't really access anything. I also don't know if I'm dying. I don't think I am. But we can turn those vents off. Oh my god, what is it? Fuck. Oh, that's you, motherfucker. My god, okay. I want to get over here, do some search. And I guess we got to start turning valves? I don't know. Oh, that's not good. Using the same electrolyte from the P-1286 power cell development, we've managed to synthesize a new kind of charged alloy. Its instability gives it its most useful future. feature. It can hold a super high voltage charge, discharging any... No, damn. Fucking reading. Discharging when coming into contact with organic material. It can be weaponized due to the uni unique characteristics of this charge. So long as the user maintains contact with the alloy, the discharge will pass right through them into the ground. This same discharge will cause catastrophic damage to all other soft tissue within range. Samples have been sent to Anomaly Defense for further development. Oh my god. Why does it sound like people screaming? 
Can I reach this? I don't know if that's doing anything. What is? No! Oh, shit! What the crap was that? The gas? My god, that scared me. I mean, I don't see why I would need to do this anymore, but yes, I will. One more. Oh! Oh, is this... Oh, another note. Using the same technology as our P-1286 City Runner cell, we've designed these mini versions. They are useful mainly for military field applications. Professor Nate Lee has requested six of these. She believes they are the answer to Project Resurgence's final stage. Awakening. I don't like the awakening talk. What are we awakening? God damn it. All right. I don't think there's anything else in here. I don't see anything. There's no, um... There's not even materials in here. Just that weird thing. Which I don't think we can do anything with. Oh, no. It looks very dangerous. Um, shit. We gotta deal with this thing? Oh, no. What happens if we go under these limbs? Nothing? Just don't go near that, right? It's bad. Bad mojo? Is there anything I'm supposed to do in here? <laughs> oh, Jesus. We gotta get to that computer over there. I'm not sure how to go about doing that. I feel like going in the center is a bad idea, but... Just stay in the center. Stay in the center, stay in the center, stay in the center! Not okay. <sighs> Symbiotic Entity Initial Findings We have finished our initial report on the anomaly sent from Westminster. We first thought it was taking the form of these old mannequins. Oh my god, look! <laughs> Which was puzzling. Turns out... They don't do this all the time. The mannequins are man-made. And the new Lyceum, in Westminster, has an abundant stock of them. The creator hollows out the internal parts for the mannequin and uses it as a host, so to speak. This explains why we have never seen them anywhere else and why they seem to have originated from the new Lyceum. By adapting, by adapting to use a humanoid form, it gains mobility that it otherwise wouldn't have. They are extremely sensitive to fire. I believe it is only a matter of time before they learn of the link between fire, their main weakness, and wood before they start inhabiting a more robust vessel. My recommendation is that they be classified as Category A anomalies. Dr. Flanders, CRO. Oh god, glass... gas... What? Activate? This is gonna kill me, isn't it? Uh, 
That didn't do anything. I guess we run. <laughs> Shit. What is that supposed to do? It's on. Error. Critical issue with this terminal. There's a note I didn't see. Turn on the gas. Shoot the pipes. Thank me later. Oh. Uh, run. Run, 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 run. Please? More? Oh, shit. Oh, it's not happy at all. Oh, fuck. Alright. Shit! Nailed it, aced it, can't be stopped. Green light means go. Nope, I said it go. Go, let's go. These poor bastards. Okay, we reached the Anomaly Research Center. Defense, stuff and things. Oh my god! Oh, oh, you gotta be fucking kidding me right now. I'm out of frickin' ammo. Shit. Shoddy. Oh, no! What the... Development report. Witch inhibition. After encountering a new, encountering a new type of witch, it was observed that she seemed to have inf some influence on the more common types. We observed that she would emit a harsh sound that changes slightly every so often. In turn, the following witches would alter their behavior. We have been synthesizing this frequency and have observed promising results. We have so far managed to inhibit their ability to teleport. Further research may lead to the control and ultimate weaponization of this particular type of anomaly. Do not deactivate the sound while the glass is unshaded. Remember, if she can see a point in space, she can move there. Jesus. Well, why... Okay, don't do that. That's not good. Should I hit the trigger? <laughs> Fuck. Here's a health. Uh, I'll just keep what we have. What? We're just going for it. Shit! We need to start using the weapon. No! Fuck. Oh no. Here. Have some fire. Is it working? Oh my god, it's not working. Why are you not working? Okay, it worked. Blah.
Okay. Uh, there's a part of me that wants to hit that switch. I have to hit the switch. This episode's gonna be very long, just so y'all know. Ready, go! Oh, that's freaking fantastic. Alright. Switch hit. I'm not fucking with that switch. She can continue screaming. Ammo. Oh my god, thank you. Shotgun ammo full. Are we reloaded on everything? Yep. Okay, these things can randomly come alive with some weird tentacle thing in the jig. That's not good. That's not good. There's no note. Not that I see anyway. No! Oh, shit! Dude, that is fucking terrifying. Project Resurgence. Oh man, I you're gonna come alive. Oh my god. Nope, no, no. Is there more shots over here? Because my ammo is empty. I guess not. Guess we're going to shotgun. Check our health. We have a huge amount of batteries. I'm gonna drop that battery. We don't have much health. Three or four, maybe? Pop a pill. I did drop a battery, but we're not really using the flashlight. Research center. Oh, there's health. Examining the doctor's cloned tissue samples. Shit! Something disturbing. The anomaly's influence has permeated far deeper than his physical form. It's as if his very DNA has been rewritten. Resurrection might bring back a body, but what kind of mind will inhabit it? God damn it. These doors open? No. Project Resurgence. Restricted area. Arc. Arc, arc, arc. You're gonna come alive. Okay, no. You don't have a body. I guess we're taking the sledge. Six meeting, Log. The project's moral implications are now at the forefront. Are we truly restoring the Doctor, or are we creating something... new? Something potentially uncontrollable? But this isn't just a scientific challenge. It's a philosophical quagmire. Philosophical... Phil blah, 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 blah. Quagmire. Giggity. Breached containment. Okay, hold on. Give me a sec. I'm gonna have a swig of this nice cold wobble pop. And now I'll read you guys a story. <clears throat> to all working at the Ark, we have been betrayed by our government. They sent their best to kill us and destroy our great city. But I have released resurgence. The doctor lives again, more powerful than ever. 
Their bullets are useless against the doctor. So long as his shield remains intact, the shield generators must be protected at any cost. He is alive, but limited. I'm sure he will deal with the invaders quickly, but he will need retire soon after. To those who are left, finish my work. If you are reading this, I am surely dead. But so are they. Crap. We have one big old boss fight, don't we? And basically only a shotgun, because this is out of ammo. We have some Molotovs, I think. Yeah, we have some. Put that on number one. We have health on two. And we have the gas on the alt. All right. I think, I don't know. I don't know if we're gonna survive this. We have four freaking ammo. Crap. All right. This is it. Big boss boy. Resurrect the doctor. Why do I, I don't, aren't we supposed to kill the fucker? Oh, shit. Okay, there's a sledge there. Maybe there's ammo. Do we have ammo? Is there ammo? Please, God, give me ammo. What are you? Oh, no. Looks like some kind of power cell. Okay. We have to hook up power cells. I really feel like resurrecting him is a shit idea. There's a blade. There's a power cell right there. We have no friggin' ammo available to us. Power cell. It's great. Is there gonna be more than one power cell? What is this? Can I turn it? Nope. Oh, this is so bad. Where is the other power cell? It's the glowing light, in case you guys didn't know. Oh boy. Oh god. Hey, Doc. He's He's got a weapon. Doc, it's okay. Defeat the Doc. Doc, everything is fine. Can I shoot that barrel? Yes. I can't go anywhere. Oh, oh my god. Can I take that? Nope. Oh shit shit. Oh yeah.
Molotov, where is he? Does he like fire? Oh, he's right here. I think. I don't know where he's at. There you are. I'm right here, dude. He's on fire. He's on fire. Ah, okay. Is he fast? I don't know if he's fit. Oh, shit. He's right there. Suck it. Oh, my God. He... So far, all he does is walk around. It's not all that um, terrifying. Until he's, like, right up in your face. He's not doing anything. That's what's weird. What am I? Oh, shit. This thing? Oh my god, he's pissed now. I just wasted. Oh god, is he fast? Yep. He's fast. Oh my god, he's right there. I don't. I don't have any more ammo. Or, uh, fire. Run! I'm wondering if I can block him. I don't know. I'm gonna try. See what happens. Ugh. Oh, shit. Ow! Ow! Are we gonna beat him? Maybe? Oh, he's all powered up. Fuck off. Take that! Nope, oh, time to go. Where's he getting his power? Did he do another thing, Majig? <laughs> Ow, dick. Oh. Oh, damn, man, he hits hard. Run! <laughs> Run for your life! Okay. We don't want to be near that. That's empty. Shit! I don't think we need to heal yet. Oh, God! Oh, reload. Time to reload. Just reload. Reload, reload, reload. Nope. Oh, God. Ow, that hurts. That hurts a lot. Oh, he's he's got his power. Shit! Rage mode. Oh, my God. I'm almost out of ammo. I don't know where he's at. Shit! Ow, ow, ow! Oh my god, heal! Okay, that was a little too close for comfort. Where's he at? Shit! Ow! Shit! Ow! Fuck. Okay, we need our hammer. I'm stuck. 
We need a new hammer. How about that? Give me. I feel like we were doing better with a hammer. Oh, that sucked, didn't it? A little counter block there. Oh no, oh no! Heal? <laughs> oh no. <laughs> Holy shit. Run! He's doing his weird thing. I think we're doing okay. I don't know what our health pack situation is. I think our weapon is about tired, though. There's another one right there, though. That's our old one. It's a pretty epic fight, but once you start understanding what he's going to do, it's not that bad. And he's down. Oh, look at this. The Dr. Sledgehammer. Oh, yeah. Oh. Oh, my. Oh, this sledge is going to be the sweetest thing ever. Look at that. Dude, we just defeated the doctor. And now we have the power of Thor. The highest level. Let's go! Bring it! How do you like that, huh? Oh, shit! Still got a hole. Yeah. We have the power of Thor. Uh, where are we going? Awakening lab? <laughs> I guess? Maybe? I don't know. The awakening lab. Wait. Cryogenic storage. Am I... I don't know. I'm confused. We're going this way. Oh, we got a note. I should have left the doctor to rot. There is nothing left of him. It was a tough fight, but he is dead for good. Perhaps my DNA, reaped from the director, is superior after all. I will return to the what to Westminster, as it turns out. It is my home after all. And as a direct descendant, no. Wait, what? And as a direct descendant, no. Copy of the director, I am its true leader. What the crap are you going on about? Oh, I forgot I'm transforming. I am Thor. And there's a computer. Do some search real quick. Oh my. That's gonna be fun. Can't... Can't go around there. Okay. Encrypted. The doctor's work continues. Sir, our work is coming along beautifully. As you have instructed, we continued and accelerated the doctor's work. We have just moved C-607 into storage. That is the C-6... That is the 607th clone. We'll be hit our target of a thousand within the next few weeks. Project Resurgence is also showing promising signs of progress. We believe we will soon be able to awaken the Doctor permanently. 
We have also sabotaged all E-Series clones. As you know, we can no longer deny the director of Westminster's request of his own clones without rousing suspicion. We have infected all the doctor's clones with an incurable sickness. All but one has died. With the last, E7, well on its way. Despite its unusual resilience, I am sure it will succumb within days. We will be ready to move on Westminster by, our, by your target date. Adapt your life, align your body, accept the future. Uh-oh. Here we go. That's another doctor, I guess? The doctor. Alright, heading into cryo. Holy shit. Created by Nathan Seedhouse. Music by James Elsie. You guys, this game was pretty freaking amazing. If you haven't tried it, you need to get it. It's on Steam. Link in the description will be in the down there. What the hell? You guys. Fantastic game. You gotta try it. Thanks for joining me. This was an amazing journey. If you want to see more, don't forget to like and subscribe. This is Wild Pop Gaming, and I will see you in the next one.